Tom, you've come here from St. Louis today. It's a 1-0 win. We're still one defeat now from 12. Overall, what did you think of the game today? Oh, amazing performance by the Rovers today. They had a tall task, you know, facing, you know, promotion contenders, Wrexham. We all know their story. We all know that they got the big money backing them. They got the big money players. And uh, they came into Wrexham, and uh, they're going back to Wales, uh, scalded butts, you know, with a, you know, 1-0 loss that uh, I think, you know, a lot of fans, both for Donny and for Wrexham four months ago, would not have expected this result. I mean, I think most Rovers fans a few months ago had this game taken place, like say in December, would have been you know thrilled with a point out of this game. But we came away with three tonight, and it was just a well-executed game plan today by Grant McCann. Absolutely. I mean, staff performance there. I know not Owen Bella was man of the match, and we've not even seen this praises all game today. Yeah. I mean, who else stood out for you in terms of other staff performers? Look, Bailey's the goal scorer, Mr. Consistent. I mean, he is the right choice for the man of the match, obviously. He's the reason why Donnie fans are going home happy tonight. But again, I will sing this man's praises as well. Joseph Oluwu tonight, stepping in on defense for the suspended Anderson. And uh, he looked every bit, you know, like he had a, a big opportunity to Day, facing the likes of Paul Mullen, facing the likes of Elliot Lee and Aldi Palmer, and he looked every bit like he belonged out there on the field. Uh, he he broke up a lot of passes. He was very uh, he he. he Man marked very tightly, I thought, and uh, both he uh, and the captain did extremely well tonight in that center back pairing. Just well done by them both, keeping keeping Wrexham off that uh, sheet. Hundred percent. I mean, we've got Morecambe coming up on Tuesday. I mean, Morecambe's going to be pretty much a different kettle of fish because we know that Morecambe's in, in decent form. We know they're chasing playoffs, but with the win against Wrexham. That's got to be a huge statement of worth of confidence. Well, I mean, really, it's just building up to a crescendo at this point because the form for Doncaster was so great going into this game. But to knock off, you know, Wrexham, you know, a team that, you know, I think a lot of their fans thought promotion was a foregone conclusion. It still could be. Um, you know, there's still a lot, of, a, lot, a lot of games left to be played. I mean, hopefully the Rovers can take that momentum into a tough Morecambe test here on Saturday. It's a, it's a tight turnaround, uh, but... Uh, you know, we'll see. We'll see what McCann has up his sleeve. He had a great game plan today with that 4-3-3, as uh, we talked about before, um, really shutting down that uh, that uh, Wrexham attack, playing the uh, defensive mid further back. Um, we'll see what he's got in store on uh, on Saturday. Absolutely, and finally for yourself, I mean. Surely today must be one of the best days of football for you. It really was. You know, in America, our soccer slash footy uh, culture is still developing in a lot of ways. And um, I, have to be, I have to watch what I say because I, you know, I understand you guys don't like soccer, the word soccer very much. <laughs> but um, no, it was, it, was, it was a fun game. It was a tense game. You know, one nil games often are, you know, tension packed and uh, lots of drama and um but more importantly as well, you know, the community atmosphere here at Equal Power with, with, with all you Rovers fans that, you know, where everybody knows your name and they're always glad that you came. That's an intro from a TV series in America called Cheers. It also applies here at uh, Donnie Rovers. This place might as well be the Cheers bar because, uh, <laughs> you know, it, it, we, this is family here and this is something that I have long desired in America and I came here to Doncaster to experience it. So really, from everyone that I met before the game during the game uh, thank you very much for welcoming a Yank into your uh, stadium tonight and uh, uh, showing me a good time I uh, hope I'll be back someday